Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're joining me for the very first time, my name is Fadjuri. I'm so happy to have you in my beautiful family and for my returning subscribers, I want to say thank you guys for always coming back to watch my videos. I really do appreciate God bless you. And if you're here for the very first time and you're yet to subscribe to join our beautiful family, please do not forget to hit on that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell. So each time I upload a new video, you are going to be the very first person to see that video. So guys, let's quickly dive right into today's video. <music> In today's video i'm going to share with you uh, a company that is actually recruiting healthcare workers from overseas and when i saw their link i actually called them to find out if they are recruiting particularly from nigeria like we all know nigeria is on the red list and they confirmed that they are recruiting from nigeria and every part of the world but you have to be a nurse for you to apply for this position so they are actually recruiting for nursing and senior carers so if you know of anybody who has a nursing degree, please do forward this video to them. Ask them to apply. You can actually apply through their website or you can send them an email. Send, they gave me their email that you can forward your CV to them if you are a nurse. In quotes, remember, if you are a nurse, if you don't have a nursing degree, don't bother to send an email to them. If you're a nurse, please do send your CV to nursing at advantacare.com for only nurses. If you have a nursing degree, even if you're in a country that is on the red list, using Nigeria as an example, because that was what I asked them and they said, yes, they are recruiting from Nigeria. So if you know of anybody who is a nurse that, that have a nursing degree, please do forward this video to them and tell them to send their CV to nursing at advantacare.com i'm going to leave the email address on the screen also i'm going to show you how you can also do the online application so when i called them i asked them that what if you don't have your neric you don't have your uh, IET certificate at the moment and you want to apply she said yes that you can actually apply even if you don't have it and they provided you have the nursing experience you have the nursing degree they will take up your application from there if you are qualified and they will tell you what to do so i'm going to leave the email in the description box as well so if you know of any nurses around you forward this video to them and tell them to apply why i demonstrate on their website but on their website if you don't have the requirements they cannot proceed with your application if you have all the requirements they can proceed but when you send your email you don't have to pass through their website application you can only apply from their website if you have all the requirements they want on their website but if you don't have that requirement they want on their website please do forward your cv to this email i am leaving on the screen and also in the description box below forward it and they will take it off from there so guys let me quickly share my screen with you and show you how their website looks like so as you can see guys we're on their website and you can see that they recruit from almost every part of the world so let me just use this as an example let's, so let's just go down you can see the first question that will ask this is a pre-screening tab so it's asking are you a uk resident and for that i said no so it took me to uh, the pre-screening so we need to check your suitability before applying for one of our jobs so begin on begin so which position are you interested in applying for let me use the position of a senior carer so if i'm going for the position of a senior carer they said do you have a nursing degree i'm going to say yes have you had the covid19 vaccine i'm going to say yes so how many years nursing experience do you have i just i'm going to leave it at one year but if you have more than, you have to indicate it here. So this continues. So have you taken a language test, which is the IELTS, OET, NERIC? Uh, let me just say, yes, I've taken NERIC. I have my NERIC. So do you hold a valid driver's license? Let me say yes. So this is going to bring us back to see if I am qualified to apply for this job. So as you can see, you say, great, you have passed our pre-screening. The next step is to start your application process. So this is if I want to begin my application. So because I have all those requirements, you can see that it is really quite easy for me to just start the process. So I'm going to do a second one without having those requirements, let's say. So let's try the second one now with filling out the 
the form the way we did with the first one but choosing the other options when we don't have the requirements so i'm just going to go to the first question which says are you a uk resident so which is no i'm not a uk resident i'm applying like someone is applying from overseas so they said pre-screening we need to check your suitability before applying for one of our jobs so let me begin this says let me go up a bit so you can see it up a bit so you can see it so which position are you interested in applying for so i'm also going to use the same senior carer then do you have a nursing degree now let me say no i do not have a nursing degree then you can see that unfortunately you have not been successful so this is a pre-screening so you make sure that before you apply for this position you have a nursing degree so let me go back again and do the one that said do you have a nursing degree then let's say yes now i have a nursing degree but i don't have the other requirements so let's see so have you had the covid 19 vaccinations yes let's choose that how many years of nursing experience do you have so i'll just leave it at one then have you taken a language test which is either one of these ielts oet uk neric no so if you don't have any of this let me go to no so you can still see that unfortunately you have not been successful so with this option you will not be successful so it's good to always get all of this requirements at hand so once it's been asked you can quickly give so but in this case you don't have to really worry if you don't have your ielts but you have your nursing degree you just have to email them your CV, which I'm going to leave the email in the description box below. Then for those that have all the requirements, I'm also going to leave the link to their website in the description box below for you to do your online application. See the demonstration, you can see that there are some requirements they want from you. So your NERIC certificate or ETI certificate or your IELTS, your driving license, which is why I always say, try to start putting all these things in place. Try to start putting them in place. So when opportunity like this come, you don't have to start going to look for them. I know of people that have missed this opportunity because of their NERIC or their IELTS certificate or driver's license. I know a few of them. So if you're someone who is trying to to relocate or to migrate to the UK through this means try to start gathering them so that when opportunity like this comes you don't miss out. I already have a video on how you can apply for your NERIC certificate if you don't know how to do that. I have a video which I'm going to leave the link in the description box below on how you can apply for your NERIC certificate or your ETI certificate and also I have a preparatory video on how you can prepare for your IELTS classes before even going for the exam so you can watch those videos and start preparing yourself so when opportunity like this comes you don't really miss out from it but never mind with Advanta Care, when I ask them they say even if you don't have this requirement that is stated on their website that you can email them your CV and they will take it up from there and see if you are qualified and they will work with you so I'm going to leave the email like I said in the description box below email your CV to nursing at advantacare.com and they will take it off from there so, and also don't forget to forward this video to your friends to any nurse you know any qualified nurse you know this is for nurses not for everybody so if you know of any nurse that has a degree because they asked me if the person i wanted to apply for have a degree and i said yeah that's okay then they can accept the cv so if you don't have a nursing degree please don't waste your data applying for this job just leave it once i see any other care job that does not require a nursing degree i will definitely come and share with you so guys we've actually come to the end of this video and you if you have enjoyed this video till now and you haven't subscribed to join our beautiful family please do not forget to hit on that subscribe button turn on the notification bell so each time i upload a new video you're going to be the very first person to see that video or you can join our telegram group where we share every information we get and secondly the advanta care they also have a phone number on their website they have inquiry contact just email them or also contact them directly and they will tell you everything you need to know so guys we've actually come to the end and i wish you good luck in all your applications and take care and see you right in my next video bye bye for now